guys. Me one today, you know. So me are going to water. And so me can find me. Now, do not worry about talking this morning. So I'm going to water because so me can find guys. Alright. After being in the water for about five minutes, I saw a yellow tail here. This was my first dive. It was there in the distance. Seems as if it's feeding. So I made a far dive and tried to sneak up on it. I reached into a range where I could take a shot. It was a long range. The fish was moving when it saw me. I still took the shot and I speared it. This was a lovely shot guys, it couldn't escape. So I'm off to a great start. That was the first shot and the first fish. I was so excited because those fish are really hard to spear. I always see them but not always I may dive at them. They are very wild. Look at him guys, it's a lovely one. I was there for another half an hour, then I saw this barracuda coming. It was coming up fast, when it saw me it started to move slow. So I made a slow dive on it. When I got into range, it turned and looked at me. And I gave it a stone shot guys. This was a lovely shot. I was there looking to see if I saw any more coming. But I didn't see any more at the time. My plan today was to stone any barracuda I saw because no one else is here to give them a second shot and my gills are very sharp I was successful with this shot look at him guys it's a lovely one see how fat he is this place is really thin a lot of times I can stone the barracudas but I don't really go for stone shot all the time because sometimes when you go for stone shot you will miss the spirit will fly over the heads or they will turn and you will miss but ever since I lost a spear to a barracuda I started to go for more stone shot so if you continue watching my videos guys you are going to see a lot of stone shots yes guys so the spear is stuck in my head so I have to come out of the water to take him out take out the spear out of my head you see that stone shot there guys? Lovely shot. I want to see how I sneak up on this as well. Yeah man, that one that one nice one like him weigh about two pounds. Yeah man, he's big enough guys. Yeah. So I set the camera so you can see what I do. The water get breezy still but I go back out the same way. I alone there here. Well me and me and God. I alone there. So I set the camera so you can see what I go on. Classic stone shot this guy. From the last one guy with my spear. A pure stone shot me I go off of. So oh, see come through this up. Off this guy, enjoy it too. Nice. And then just dry it too.
see that? Easy. Uh, put it back on this. So that's why we set it up like this, you know. So when it, it, it spears stuck in the head, and uh, we try to just pull that and get it back easy. You see? Alright. Spear active again. Lovely barracuda. Yeah man. Lovely yellow tail. So we are go back out because where we can find guys. So just stay tuned. Jai me back in the water now guys. Alright. Just as I re-entered the water, I saw this mackerel. It was coming from behind me. I made a dive on it. But it didn't give me any chance. Some away from me. This was a lovely one. That I didn't get any chance with it. I saw a lionfish here. It lives underneath this rock. Whenever I want to spear him, he's not there. But whenever I'm not in the mood to spear them, I always see him. I made a dive here just to record him. I am not in the mood for spearing it today. These fish are very easy to spear, as you can see there. I was poking it with my spear. So it's really easy to spear them. I let that one go for today, but one day I will spear it. I saw these bonitas coming up. I just took a quick shot at it. I didn't even hear him because these fish are very quick. I saw another yellow tail here. This one was smaller than the previous one. I tried to sneak up on this one as well. But this one pick up the rake and head for the deep like a missile. Can you see that? Ah. So I didn't get any chance there. I saw a blue bat jack here. It seems as if it was feeding. So I made a far dive on it, hoping to sneak up on it. I was successful with this dive. I got in shooting range. And I also took a shot. And I speared this fish. This fish is the fish I ate for breakfast. So stay to the end of the video guys and we will see how I prepare it. It's a nice one up late job guys. What do you call these type of jacks in your area? I call them blue bat jacks. So that was the last shot for the day guys. So join me back online. Yes guys, I don't want to see what's going on already. You know, so I don't have to really say nothing. You see me guys, a lovely one. You see him fat. Nice to get it up. Yeah. Lovely yellow tail. Now we about two pounds, you know, guys. Go closer to this is a big one. You know. I fried that jacket for my breakfast, you know. So I'm scale them now, guys. So stay tuned now, watch our boy. I'll set the camera so you can see me I want.
abastecendo a gás. Catch this guys. Wash them off now guys and then get ready to go. Yes guys so I dropped this so I may fry for breakfast. I'm we'll just put a little seasoning on him and put that. Yeah man. So I fry fish may eat and bread for breakfast. I split the fish now after I might to put all for going in the pot. So I yeah, like the now I put them in. Guys, so you don't know, you know, a fresh fish for breakfast in the class. 
Yes, guys. I like my fish, them giant. Fresh fish for breakfast, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. So that's the end of the video, guys. Thanks for watching. And please remember.